Hey there, this is Chad from Zombie Fight Shark, and today we are going to go over how to import your own samples into Travelizer within Reactor. So when I was trying to figure out how to do this for myself, I was surprised and amazed at how few resources there were, so uh, hopefully this makes it simple. So we want to change this wave up here. First, click this little wave symbol, so you get open up your... Uh, little wave table. You can click these little eyeglasses things if you want to. Up to you. I don't think that's really necessary, but hey, there they are. And so we need to get the waveform down here into this little section. So I go to files and uh, I've got a wave on my desktop. I'm going to grab it, drop it in. Okay, simple enough. Now, here's the part that took me forever to figure out. See if I click on this and then I look down at root and low and high. See, oh, they're all four. And then you go down the line three, five, etc. So all of these, they're all dedicated to a certain sample number. And this one, 126. So I'm like, well, what do I do to change that number? How do I make that happen? Change that to, I'm going to change it to seven in this case. And all of these are going to end up being seven. When you change the low it changes other stuff so you can just change the low to whatever number and then this really important box match needs to match that and watch we make it seven voila there is my wave it changed now I can actually play that wave And so you can mess with all these settings just like you would on a normal Travelizer preset. I uh, hope all that makes sense to you. If you have any questions, please feel free to post a comment below. And thank you for watching. We'll see you next time.